automation, cost pressure, and ever-decreasing component sizes, demands on materials are constantly increasing. Mechanical components are often subjected to enormous material strain. Small, inconspicuous flaws lead to material failure and sometimes even serious consequences, from additional costs for repairs to production standstill. Dr. Summer Werkstofftechnik analyzes failure mechanisms and develops strategies for solving problems together with clients. You have to be a bit of a detective, always readjusting yourself to the case and finding the right arguments and solutions as to why the damage occurred in the first place. The national and internationally sought after material detectives at Dr. Sommer Werkstofftechnik are experienced specialists in material analysis. The team does everything to track down the causes of material flaws. Every year, employees conduct over 1,000 material and damage analyses along with a large number of initial sample inspections. When the component is released for examination, we begin with standard tests, from the basic documentation all the way to scanning electron microscopy. Dr. Sommer Werkstofftechnik is DIN EN ISO 17025 accredited and DIN EN ISO 9001 certified. More than 30 state-of-the-art testing and analysis procedures are available to the experienced material detectives for their investigation work. What are the main challenges? The challenge is to get the job done in a time period which is fast for the customer. Let's say, for example, an automotive industry conveyor belt comes to a halt. This can lead to very high consequential damages, even though the cause of the damage might only have been a secondary component. But when production stops, that's usually the bigger damage. But also the challenge is that it can be one of two and a half thousand different materials. So you have to be an expert on the subject and know the entire range and spectrum. On the expert's table is a colorful mixture of all sorts of parts and components. Broken screws, defective drive shafts, torn welds and much more. The experts write up conclusive reports, create mechanical technological initial sample tests, and offer competent advice on the use of materials as well as precise process analyses. We actually meet daily and discuss precisely where we are with the inspection. More than 700 customers worldwide rely on the profound expertise of Dr. Sommer Werkstofftechnik. In staff meetings, a most diverse range of damage cases are freshly placed on the table and discussed in a resource and solution oriented manner. An everyday example, screws for fixing electrical connections in household appliances. These were broken, resulting in the recall of 33,000 appliances. We have to check whether the screws were actually hydrogen embrittled or not. Mrs. Fantol, this is a job for you to look into. Due to the large number of potential reasons for the damage and analysis methods, the selection of the right examination method is decisive in order to quickly reach a meaningful conclusion. For fracture identification, a scanning electron microscope is used. Here you look to see whether the fractured surface is a brittle fracture or a ductile fracture. Due to the variety of damage cases, scanning electron microscopy is increasingly used to determine samples as regards their structure. Here, we are at nearly 6,000 times magnification, where we can see very fine intercrystalline fractures. 
gaping grain boundaries, and we have microcrystal honeycombs on the intercrystalline fractures. This is a clear indication of hydrogen embrittlement. A first clue. In the next investigation phase, the so-called stress test, the susceptibility to hydrogen embrittlement is tested. If this screw breaks within the next 96 hours, then we have clear proof of hydrogen embrittlement. In the end, we were able to reliably detect the hydrogen-induced brittle fracture. The nature of the break was quite typical, as well as the hardness. So I think both companies learned something here, namely to stock and supply hydrogen-free screws in the future. Also part of the damage in material analysis are numerous unusual objects, ranging from broken bearings for wind generators to defective dental drills to a construction crane that crashed onto an office building during a hurricane. And at the focus of the question is the cause. During the accident investigation for the overturned crane, we conducted a preliminary meeting with our team and found that the actual cause was a strong gust of wind. The crane manufacturer wants to make sure that the storm was the only cause. A demanding task. First, the defective forging is tested for toughness. For this purpose, a test piece is cut from the defective component and processed into a standardized sample using a surface grinding machine. The sample has such an appearance. It has a dimension of 10 by 10 by 55 millimeters and a corresponding depth groove of 2 millimeters. And this is a standard compliant sample, which must be produced in this way. Cooled to minus 20 degrees, the sample is smashed in a standard pendulum impactor to determine the toughness of the material. We have found that the forging components were very brittle, which is why these brittle components have to be removed from the crane system at all costs. Today, Dr. Sommer Werkstofftechnik is one of the leading materials institutes in the German-speaking world. Industrial customers appreciate the combination of expertise, expert advice, and an extensive equipment fleet. Speed alone is not always a guarantee for success. For us, it's actually not always about the speed, but more importantly about guaranteeing the reliability of the measurement results. That's why we don't only read the results off the machine, but also interpret and check these for correctness. Reliability and independence are the building blocks for the success of the Dr. Sommer Werkstoff Technik company. Every successful and objectively developed analysis means the avoidance of further damages and the reduction of resultant costs. Not only are damages assessed in the laboratory, analyzing materials for initial sample inspections are also a regular daily activity, an example from the wind power industry. If a new subcontractor wants to become part of the production of planetary gears, an initial sample inspection is necessary. This means that the customer will ask his subcontractor to create a corresponding component, and then this component will be tested thoroughly. A small piece is sawn out of the large component in order to prepare an initial sample. From this, microstructural data is recorded and the chemical composition measured. Not until all results correspond with the client's specifications is the subcontractor approved. The Dr. Sommer Werkstoff Technik Company stands for highly reliable results that we can reproduce every time, which means quality is our top priority. Dr. Sommer Werkstoff Technik always aspires to be an absolutely reliable partner. No matter how great or small, for us, no job, no damage is too little so as not to deserve our attention. Was ist los?